Hello fun. A while ago I saw a video by Accidental Games which showed that hoppers cause quite a bit of server-side lag. I want to do that same test and test a few more things. First off, I want to recreate this scenario. I want to test just how many hoppers it takes to get the TPS down to 10. And then I want to test how many hoppers with a furnace above them it takes to take the TPS down to 10. I want to do these two tests in both 1.8 and 1.8.3 because since 1.8.2 uh, Minecraft has improved hopper uh, performance so I want to see if that is significant I'm also going to test it quickly in Spigot to see uh, how much it uh, how, how well it does in Spigot uh, Spigot is based on uh, Minecraft 1.8 but they also improve hopper performance so it might be better than 1.8 I also want to test how the items flowing through hoppers affects the, the lag. And finally I want to test how mobs, how, how much lag mobs cause. And I want to see if reducing the if turning off the AI reduces the lag. I've prepared a test world here which has an in-game uh, TPS counter from YouTuber Peppermint. I will link him in the description. And currently the world already has 10,000 hoppers, it's uh, 100 by 100, so we can, uh, you can see the TPS is right around 20 at the moment, it's not 100% accurate, but it's definitely good enough. Um, so it's still 20, so we can just start uh, cloning these hoppers and see when the TPS starts going down to 10. Okay, so this is correct, so let's see with how we do with 20,000. Still 20 TPS, so let's increase this to 6. Let's see, 17 TPS, that's definitely starting to kind of go down. Um, might actually, let, let's see, oh, we have even more, okay. Um, okay, so this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, um, so that's 80,000 hoppers, and that gets the TPS down to around eight. Okay, so that's actually, it's a lot of hoppers. Um, let's see how it increases, how the lag decreases when we put furnaces above them. So this sh should work. Okay, so 80,000 hoppers with furnaces above them causes virtually no lag. So let's double it again. So at first we will have um, only the hoppers so we will have quite a bit of lag then we put furnaces above them okay so we have 160,000 hoppers with uh, furnaces above them and although it looks really bad the server is doing pretty well it's at just above 10 TPS. <coughs> so I would actually say that it's a little bit more than twice as, as uh, laggy, the hopper without a furnace above it, which actually isn't that much, although it definitely helps. So now let's test the items. Uh, okay, we're now back at 80,000 hoppers. And I'm gonna now replace this block with a dispenser with some items in it. So let's just do that. Okay, so obviously at first the TPS goes down a bit, but it actually keeps going down. It seems to be stabilizing a bit. It's between 8 and 9. So let's just replace the. The, the, yeah okay so there's like there were two stacks in here so there's 
almost every uh, hopper has an item now. Um, but let's replace the furnaces with air again. See how much worse that is. Uh, okay, let's wait for it to stabilize a bit. Okay, so transporting items then it, it actually it's with with or without tile on these above them it's just as bad okay so let's test this in 1.8.3 uh, okay i'm now in 1.8.3 and let's see how well this does so let's first double let's double it again No problems still, I assume. And this is where the 1.8 started to get trouble. It was at 17 TPS. And this looks to be about the same. It's, it's still stabilizing, I think. Actually, it does look like it's better, slightly better. Not, not too much, but seems to be slightly better it's 19 instead of 17 so let's just um, get a racing block um, put furnaces above all of them then of course there will be no more lag um, and then not double them once more see because this was the point where the 1.8 really started having trouble okay so this 1.8.3 server really doesn't do much better than the 1.8 server it looks like it's slightly improved but not by much so let's see how this spigot server does with okay we're now on spigot and this is the point where 1.8 and 1.8.3 started having trouble but Spicket seems to be doing perfectly fine still um, so let's just clone it one more time so let's double it like this and after the initial lag it actually seems to it, this is really surprised me like it, it this is a way better performance than I expected it's at this point the vanilla servers even with uh, furnaces above them were started having a lot of trouble so let's okay <laughs> um, this might not work but let's just double it once more obviously it goes the um, start and this is really impressive it's it's only 17 dps it's you can have four times as much is that correct this, at least it's way more okay so we have a decent <laughs> decent value now so let's see what happens when we put furnaces above them so let's this is above all of them it seems to be doing worse with furnaces above them which is very strange um, let's wait a little bit longer because this isn't updating but I'm pretty sure that's just it updated server side but it just it takes a while to send it to the client okay yeah it, it really does seem like there's more lag with furnaces than without on spigots. Let's replace it with air again, so we can see if it really is better. Uh, okay, so the furnaces are now removed, and there is a lot less lag. So it's really surprising, but on spigot you shouldn't put furnaces on hoppers because that will actually increase the lag okay 
So let's just quickly test how many mobs it takes to get down to this ticks per seconds to this leg, um, just so we can roughly estimate how how bad they are. Okay, let's test how many zombies it takes to get the TPS down. So let's double the amount of zombies. This is 4, 8, 16, 32, 61, 28, 265, 512, 1000. 24 and it starts to go down 1024 2048 yes 2048 is does get the tps down a lot so if we turn off the ai it gets quite a bit better although about twice twice the tps so it does get quite a bit better, but not that much. Okay, so it's about 2048 zombies. And let, let's see how many hoppers uh, that would be. Uh, okay, I did some calculations. And zombies are around 200 times laggier than hoppers. Which would mean that you can have uh, 200 hoppers for every uh, zombie on the server because that would cost the same amount of lag although zombies don't appear to cause any lag when you are a little bit far away because if you want to get uh, closer they actually start like generating a lot of lag and for some reason even if you turn off the uh, the uh, AI they still cause a bit of lag um, and then if you go away they stop causing lag so I'm not sure why they're why they cause lag if the AI is off but they do okay thanks for watching